and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're brand new here. For today's video I have quite a large Shein and Boohoo haul. So there is a lot to get through. I have three very large bags sitting beside me so I'm just going to jump right into it. If you want to see what I picked up for Shein and Boohoo this time around just keep watching. So I'll say this haul has got a bit of everything in it. I've got clothing, shoes, jewellery, accessories, phone cases, there's office wear, there's active wear, there's holiday clothes, there's a bit of everything. Right so I'm just going to get into it. <laughs> first pair of shoes I picked up are quite an essential. They're just these white slip-on canvas shoes. Now, I'm not sure if these are going to be comfortable or not because the fabric is very, very thin around the side and all along the top, but I will need to try them on. But there's sometimes I want to wear a white shoe. But all the white shoes I have, I don't really want to wear. They've either got a logo on them or some form of design. I just want plain white. So I picked these up off of Shein. I will put the prices on the screen and I will try and link everything down below if I can still find the product. I've had a pair of these before, actually. I think I should just invest in a pair of white slip-on vans. I'll, I'll, get, I'll get white vans, but until then, <laughs> I will use these. Don't know why I didn't think of that before. You know. Okay. Next pair of shoes I have, I was not going to buy them. I've seen them everywhere. Lots of celebrities are wearing them. Almost everyone on TikTok's wearing them. They're kind of like the in shoe at the moment. But I wasn't going to buy them because I'm a croc gal. I love my crocs. They're so comfy. If you don't like crocs, then you need to just grow up. Anyway, I seen a pair on Shein. So I wasn't going to spend a lot of money just in case I end up not wearing them. So I seen them on Shein and I thought, you know what? I'm going to get them. I'm going to see if I wear them. And if not... Put them on Vinnie, put them on Depop, get rid of them, whatever, right? So, I have picked up a pair of these slip-on mules. I do think they're so cute. Like, they are cute and I've seen different ways to style them, like on TikTok and stuff. But yeah, nice light brown tan colour. I have tried them on and they fit like a glove, so they might be my new Crocs. Okay, my third pair of shoes are for an upcoming holiday, actually. Uh, it's actually ridiculous. I'm still buying holiday clothes, considering... How much clothes and shoes I have in my holiday suitcase. I have wanted a pair of sandals like this for the longest time. Couldn't ever find a pair that I liked. And when I did, it was out of season. I didn't have holidays coming up, so I never bought them. So I've seen them on Shein. They're very 90s style, which I love. So these are the sandals here. Flip-flop style with a slight wedge. Now, I've had a pair like this before, but the wedge was huge. They were very uncomfortable. These are more in the style that I was going for. Obviously, these have been around for a while now. They came back into style about two or three years ago. I just love them. I think they're going to be so comfortable. My go-to shoe on holiday. Can't even properly see them. I'm terrible at holding shoes. There we are. You get the full effect. But like I said, very 90s, which I'm all about. Okay, I'm going to move on to clothing. I'm not going to give any rhyme or reason to this. I'm just going to grab as I see because it is a lot. I've actually wore three shirts. I'm going to go through those first so I can just kind of throw them to the side so I can put them in the wash in. So this is the first shirt. I'm not going to lie, I picked up in two different colours. I'm at that age. Something's nice. I like the fit. All of that kind of stuff, I'm buying it in multiple colours. Anyway, we just have a short sleeve shirt and it actually has like a little layering on the sleeve I think it's really really cute and it's in Dalmatian print so it is summer I do like wearing shirts and blouses to work so I wanted some short sleeve ones so it's not too hot in the office basically so I've had this on already like I said it's really lightweight and it fits really nicely and I really like the sleeves I really like how it's got this layered effect on the sleeves so yeah shirt number one <laughs> if you know me you know I love animal print I'm wearing snake print at the moment cheer print is my absolute favourite but I like zebra too. It's a long sleeve shirt and the sleeves are quite baggy. I noticed that when I was wearing it yesterday, which I love. I love kind of like a balloon sleeve or a baggy sleeve with my shirt. I just think it adds something to the shirt. So I don't know if you can see, but there is a red mark here. I dropped a strawberry down it yesterday. I could have kicked myself. I'm like, I'm literally filming a haul tomorrow and I've dropped a strawberry. But I've just been, I've been open and honest. I've told you I wore some of these shirts already, so it's absolutely fine. But yeah, has a wee pocket here. Love that. I don't know what else to say. You know I'm like this in hauls, but yeah, zebra print shirt. Okay, this next shirt is a prime example of, if I like it, I'm buying it in different colours. If you're a loyal watcher on my video, you will have seen this exact shirt in a different colour in one of my previous Shein hauls. So I first picked this shirt up in green. Now I have picked up in this nice pinky salmon colour. I honestly just love the fit of this. The sleeves cuff in at the wrist, it's got this shirring over your breast area and then it peplums out. I never used to like peplum at all until I started having to wear office wear and 
Honestly, I think peplum really suits me, especially because I hate my lower stomach, just because it's a bit round, you know? And I feel like the peplum really helps that. It covers it, it's nice, I honestly love it. Um, I wear my green one to death, I'll probably wear this one to death, and I'm not gonna lie, I've got it in another colour. So, I will probably wear all three of these shirts to death, because like I said, the peplum look, I really like it. Next shirt you're probably thinking, what the hell? It's giving me Fresh Prince of Air vibes, but it's very like 80s, bordering 90s vibe. More so 90s actually, this is 90s vibe. I just thought the colours were so nice together on the model. Oh my god, I honestly fell in love with this shirt. But now I've got it here, I have tried to wear it. I was going to wear it on Monday to work and I just stopped myself. I don't know why, I don't know. I think I'll need to style it in a different way because I do love it. It's just very different for me. I've not worn a shirt like this in a very long time. I do love my patterns, but this is just a bit different. So I will need to learn to style it. It's quite oversized as well, which I do love because I would be able to wear it kind of with shorts, with cycle shorts maybe, you know. I could wear it with a lot of things and obviously tuck it in. Um, it is a large, I buy almost everything from Shein. And a large, sometimes extra large. I do love it. It has big balloon sleeves as well, which I do love. Okay, so you have seen this shirt before. It's the white one I showed you earlier, but this is a black version. So, like I said, if I like something, I will now buy it in a few colours, just because I know I'm going to like it. I do want to have it in different colours. Um, because different colours go with different things, make up different outfits, you know. So this is just a black version. I will say this is polka dot and not Dalmatian print like the white one. So next, another short sleeve shirt. I'm really into the short sleeves for summer, obviously. Very, very lightweight. It's almost like linen kind of material. It has got a slit up the side as well. And it has bat wing sleeves, which I love. I love a bat wing sleeve, especially on short sleeves, as it's very long as well, which I like. Nice to be tucked into things. Sometimes I feel like I'm very bad at hauls because describing clothing, it's, it doesn't come naturally to me. Um, so I just hope you like seeing the clothes and all that. This is my first time seeing a lot of these clothes because I haven't actually taken a lot of them out of the bags. So some of this is my genuine raw first reactions. So we have another long sleeve shirt. Another pattern shirt, as always. I'm right into patterns. I love my patterns. There's very rarely that I will wear a plain shirt. But we have long sleeve. This shirt isn't as long in the body, um, but we are just lucky I wear a lot of high-waisted trousers to work, so it can be tucked in. Um, but yeah, nice. I have a shirt like this from Zara, but it's almost opposite, so it's like this nice beige colour all over, and it has the black lines everywhere. Okay, we have seen this shirt already. This is the black version. I honestly love the black version. I don't know why I didn't buy this sooner. I think it's because I wanted to wear more colour. But yeah, this is the black one. Peplum, Russian, long sleeve. I actually love the black one. Can't say anything else about it. I've got the shirt in three colours now. I honestly forgot about this shirt. So another peplum kind of Russian up here top. This shirt has got short sleeves and it's kind of like, what do you call that kind of effect? It does balloon out and this will cinch in at your upper arm. But I just honestly think that's so cute. I don't know if it's too cute for me. I didn't realise it had stitchings all over here. Um, and I think stitching like that can make things more like cutesy and nice. But I'll need to try it on. I think it looks so cute. I completely forgot I ordered this. It does look a bit on the small side. Um, I did order a large. Um, so I will need to try this on and see how we fit. Next I actually have a two piece set. Very long oversized shirt but it is kind of knitwear so it is going to be a bit see through but very very oversized. I think it's so nice. I've actually got this in my basket in a few colours but I wanted to try one before I bought them all. Because it's knitted I kind of thought it might be a bit see through which I hate for like loungewear sets and cycle shorts and stuff. But I will need to try it on because, like I say, this shirt is very long. It might cover my bum completely and I might not bother if it's see-through. Here are the shorts to go with it. Cycle shorts, but again, knitted kind of material. This will just be like a house set, something I'll wear around the house. I love wearing two-piece sets like this anyway. But yeah, I will need to try this on and see how we go with this. Then, I'm not going to lie, I went a bit mad for cycle shorts. I love cycle shorts. I want them in all different patterns. So... I bought some in different patterns. So here is the first pair I picked up, classic checkerboard. Honestly, I love this print. Love checkerboard print. It just reminds me of Vans and I love my Vans. So um, I am a bit skeptical that these are going to be a bit see-through as well because I have got another pair of cycle shorts from Shein, half black, half white. The white side is very see-through. 
Um, I will say that about Shein's clothing. The majority of white clothing, if it's this kind of material, is going to be a bit see-through. Here are the next pair. You know, I love animal print. I bought two things that are zebra print this time round. That's actually quite funny. But zebra print, cycle shorts. And I think these are like the shorter cycling shorts. Um, because this crotch area is very short and small. So these might be the shorter cycling shorts opposed to the very long ones. They're so cute. I cannot wait to pair these with big baggy t-shirts. It's such an easy outfit to throw together. Cycle shorts, big baggy t-shirt and you're done. Sorry if the camera angles changed or anything like that. I had to delete footage from my camera because the memory card was very full. So, like I've tried to tell you three times now, how cute are these? They're off-white kind of cream underneath. And then of course we have the green leopard print on top. I just absolutely love these. Honestly, love them. Leopard print is my favourite animal print ever. And I just think these are so cute. Honestly, love these. Then I couldn't pass up on the regular leopard print. These cycle shorts have a very thick waistband as well. And they do seem a lot thicker. So they're not going to be see-through. Then I just picked up a pair of black cycle shorts, plain black. I like the material of these, they're kind of like lycra as well, which I love. The other black cycle shorts I have are cotton, which I'm not the biggest fan of. They have pockets, so there's a pocket kind of at the back here and there's a pocket at the side. Cycle shorts with pockets, that's where it's at. This is what I need. Last trouser item, I did pick up a pair of flared black trousers. Now I am risking it for a biscuit with Shein bottoms because some of the trousers just don't fit at all. But pick these up. Very, very lightweight, almost linen material. They have pockets with buttons lining them, which I think is quite a nice wee detail. And it's got your tie string as well. Um, they look really nice. They don't look like they're going to be see-through. They look like they're going to be a nice length on me. But again, I will need to try them on because a lot of these things I haven't actually tried on yet. Okay, completely forgot about this little top, but I've just got a little striped black and white tank top. Just a staple piece to have in my wardrobe. Okay, that is all the shoes and clothing completely done, but I do have a bag full of jewellery, accessories and different things, so I'll get into that bag now. First and largest thing we have in here is a new bag. I did have high hopes for this bag. I wanted a new work bag because my work bag is very large, but since trying this, I now realise I need to have a very large work bag because I like to put my lunch bag in it, my big water bottle, I like to have everything in my one bag and just carry it. I hate carrying numerous bags when I'm working. Um, so I need to find another purpose for this. I tried to put everything in this for work, but it just didn't fit. Anyway, so it's just black bag, has a long strap, and you have your short straps as well. This isn't going to be my new work bag, sadly. And I did like it because it had the long strap, and I wish my bag had the long strap. But you can't have it all. Next, I have picked up another heatless hair curling set. Now I have one already, I bought it from Amazon, but it's so annoying, it's not just like one band, it's like two bands and then there's a bit of fabric in the middle that sits here and it just doesn't do what I wanted to do. It doesn't stay in my hair, so I've ordered another one. Right, I ordered a Shein, I'm going to try it because I want to use these. <laughs> I want to wear them and make my life so much easier, I don't want to spend time curling my hair, I just want to do this. Right, and I've used my one once, through gritted teeth because it was so difficult to use. I've bit the bullet, bought a new one, bought it in black. Sorry if the angles changed again, I had to change the camera battery. Let's move on. So next I picked up two phone cases. Now my phone case that is on my phone is relatively new but I like being able to change my phone cases out. The only thing is I only have one pop socket but this isn't an issue with this phone case I have chosen. So it came in two pieces. This is the phone case black and white pattern and it says good and then it also comes with one of these phone charms black and white bead um, and obviously you just put that through the phone case on your phone can you imagine the vision next now i have wanted one of these phone cases in a while after being on holiday and a festival it just kind of pushed me to get this phone case more and um, it also pushed me to get a camera strap for around my neck because I just hate going out in my bag, and out in my bag, just have it around my neck like a proper tourist. Perfect. So this is the next phone case. I think it's so cute, it's kind of wavy. Wavy effect in the black, and it's got a long strap, so you can put it around your neck, on your arm, anything like that. It just makes it so much easier. Um, you can always have it on you. When I'm at work, and I'm not wearing trousers with pockets, that is the bane of my life. I could use this phone case. On holiday, could use this phone case. Festivals. Could use this phone case. Do you know the possibilities are endless and I just thought it was cute. 
So this haul is very random. Um, there is a mismatch of different things. I picked up this little pouch, okay? So this is from the technology kind of section. Little pink pouch, I thought it was cute. Very petite, but I wanted this for my camera batteries. A wee pouch of it there and then things can just sit in here. So I've got it for my camera batteries. It's basically gonna be for traveling and keeping all my camera things together so all my camera batteries can go in here and then this little pouch will go in my camera bag. Next I'll move on to some jewellery pieces. I love Shein's jewellery. I just wish it was sterling silver but who can complain? Do you know? Firstly I picked up a set of rings. I love Shein's rings. Honestly the amount of sets I have bought it's it's no right. These are the rings here. Big chunky ones which I'm back into liking. I like these ones especially because they look like games cards but yeah this is the ring set I have Okay, next, what do we have? A little pair of earrings. Oh, these are very similar to the earrings I'm actually wearing just now. Um, I think these are from Shein as well, actually. So they're just Diamante Love Hearts hoops. So these are very similar. These are the earrings here. Little star hoops. I think they're so cute. I can't wait to wear these. Okay, another pair of hoops. Wow, up. I honestly love these. Okay, these are the next pair of hoops I picked up. Can't really see very well, but it's just kind of a funky shape. Funky shaped hoop. I just think they're really nice. Funky but classy. They are a bit chunky and have got a bit of weight to them, which I really like. But yeah, nice pair of funky shaped hoops. Oh, okay, another pair of hoops. Rhiannon, you went a bit mad for the earrings this time. I mean, I do love my earrings, so I have had a pair of hoops like this before, but I had to get rid of them, so I've repurchased them. Love her hoops. I think they're really nice, and they do have like a bit of a funky shape to them as well. They're not just smooth. Then I picked up a necklace, and it says Libra. It says Libra. I've wanted a necklace like this for so long, so good old Shein has my star shine on a necklace. I can already tell I'm gonna wear this so, so much. Lastly, I bought two anklets. Well, technically two packets of anklets because this comes in a set of two. First set is a set of two, black and white with the yin yang. Then the next one, honestly, I am in love with this. I cannot wait to wear this, especially on holiday. So this anklet set is a set of three. So first off, we have this beaded one, cream with the little blue beads. Then we just have a silver one with silver beads. And the full reason I got this anklet, which is silver and has the evil eye all around it. Those three together are gonna look so nice. So that is everything I got for Shein. What a massive haul. I cannot wait to try everything on, put everything away. You know the feeling after a haul. When bags of clothes have just been sitting there, you cannot wait to get them away. But this haul is not finished yet. I want to show you the few pieces I picked up from Boohoo. Boohoo, as always, have an amazing sale on. So I'm going to show you the few pieces I got for Boohoo. Um, yeah. So I did pick up three pairs of jeans because the price, oh my God. This is the first pair of skinny jeans I bought. I'm not going to lie, I have bought this pair before. The back pocket ripped, so I had to bin them. So when I've seen these for a very discounted price, I had to get them. These were once my all-time favourite blue jeans. I did then pick up another pair of light wash skinny jeans um, and they have a nice slit at each knee. Um, I did buy these because look at the price. How can you go wrong with a pair of jeans for that price? You can't go wrong can you? So that's why I picked them up. This next set I am so not sure of because for the longest time I've only worn like lighter wash jeans and black. I wear black jeans all the time. But I seen these and I was like, do you know what? I'm going to try this. I'm going to try it out and see if I can style them. It's like older style to wear dark wash jeans. So I picked these up. They're the exact same as the light wash has a distressing down the front. Um, but yeah, I just picked these up. I want to see if I can style a dark wash jean as well. Okay, next. This is where I'm getting a bit nervous. The next two items of clothing I have are both potential night out outfits for tomorrow. And I have not tried them on yet. Why am I so last minute? I'm going out tomorrow. If none of these fit, I have nothing to wear. Oh my god, they are they are not fitting me. I'm telling you that right now. These are a 14 and they are not fitting me. But I have picked up pleather snake print trousers. They are a bit flared, but I'm just, I'm telling you right now from looking at those, these are not fitting me. I mean, I'll be very surprised if they do. But yeah, here on the back it has pockets on each side of the bum. I do love these and if I do end up fitting my fat ass into these, 
And if I do end up wearing them, I will just be wearing them with probably an orange kind of bodysuit or a black bodysuit, I'll need to see. It, the weather has been really strange here recently. It has been chucking it down with rain, but it's still been hot. And I think that's what the weather's meant to be like tomorrow, so I don't know. I don't want to sweat and play there. Okay, and option number two. I think, oh, honestly, I think this is what I'm going to be going towards. Really not something I thought I would ever go for, but clearly I was drawn to it because I couldn't not buy it. Um, I had it on my wish list for a while. So I just could not buy it, okay. Black dress, oh it's a lot thicker than I thought it was going to be. Nice, I thought it was going to be really see-through. Oh yeah, the sleeves are see-through, that's why. Okay, so it's just this dress, I don't know how to describe it. It's kind of like a baby doll dress. It's got an underskirt and then it's sheer on top. We have the long sleeves that kind of balloon and then cuff in here. We have a tie at the neck and of course it's covered in green stars. So yeah this is option number two, obviously I'm going to try it on so you'll be able to see it better because that was just a terrible way of showing you. Um, but that is my two options for going out tomorrow so let's hope at least one of them fits. So now that is all I have for today's haul. Now I need to go and try everything on, put everything away, tidy everything up which is probably the worst thing to do after the whole video. But if you enjoy seeing what I got for Boohoo and Shein, don't forget to like and subscribe. I could really use your support. And until next time, see you in my next video. Bye.